killed in shooting incidents. Eight people were killed in Philadelphia with 27 others hurt. And it's just something that we, we, need, to, we need to do something about. And if the state and federal government don't want to don't want to stand up to the NRA and some other folks, then let us, let us police ourselves. But they preempt us on all kinds of gun control legislation. A state of emergency, a move that will commit more money. Keep your radios locked. Are you mad or no? Big mad, little man. It makes me real mad. I'm, I'm going to say or no. I'm pissed to the max. Talk to me. Oh, yeah, it makes me very angry. Yep, yep, to the yep, yep. You already know what time it is. It's your girl, POC. I'm back in these Philadelphia streets asking, despite record-breaking homicides and urges from city officials and activists, Mayor Jim Kenney has stated that he's not ready to declare a state of emergency, citing potential threats to civil liberties. So I hit the streets of Philadelphia to ask many residents, are they mad or not? W-H-Y-Y. You already know what time it is. It's your girl, POC. What's that? Yup, yup, to the yup, yup. Y'all right now. That's what I needed. Thank I used to play in the spark. So like me, I was telling the people, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I'm from this neighborhood, like, you know, and I, rap was one of my dreams. When I was in school, and they said, what you want to be when you grow up? I wanted to be an airline pilot, and I wanted to be a rapper. Mm -hmm. And now that I'm a rapper, I fly just as much as an airline pilot, and I'm fly as shit. <laughs> <laughs> I kill two birds with one stone. And I got, I got to definitely ask you this last question. My point question. is, okay. if I could do it, y'all could do it too. Like, you know, if I could be successful, take care of my family, and, and live my dream, anybody can do it. You just got to believe in yourself. Put God first, believe in yourself, and put the work in. You can make it happen. Okay, we need that. So let me ask you this last question, especially because you just did a performance with the son of the 215, and the name of the song is called State of Emergency. Yeah. As we all know what's happening in the city of Philadelphia with yeah. gun violence and things like that, mm -hmm. but the mayor has not called the city, you know, as far as the state of emergency for the city. Does that make you mad? I mean, it's definitely a state of emergency. You know, I don't think it's only on the mayor. I think it's on all of us to come together and do what we can do to, uh, you know, the curve all this negativity and all the violence that's going on in the hood. Like, you see, we out here. We This is the fucking hood. We West Philly. I got, like, 80,000 on, and we in the hood. Like, you know what I'm saying? You, and, and we comfortable because that's where I'm from, and it's all love. We killing each other at a rapid pace, and it needs to stop, man, because we, I lost family members. People people are dying every day. The news is depressing, man. So we got to figure it out. It's not only on the mayor. It's on all of us. It's on community leaders. It's on the parents that, you know, let their kids out the door every day. It's on all of us. We got to come together and come, with, come up with some solutions for what's going on. That's real. And my last question, you know what I'm saying? You got Freedom Freedom Thinker Academy across your chest, you know? Mm -hmm. What is that and how can that help with what's going on in the city? We're helping. Freedom Thinkers Academy is music, health, education, and culture. On the education side, we have work, STEM workforce certification programs for people that might be getting out of school and might not know what direction they want to go in or maybe they don't want to go to college, but they want to earn a living for their family. So we provide some courses where you can take the course, you pass the course, you get a workforce certification, you go straight into the workforce, start earning anywhere between thirty-five to seventy-five thousand dollars a year. So that's good money. So it's more than just being flies, what you're saying? Yeah, for sure. Exactly. <laughs> I appreciate you, Free. Thank you. Tune in. 90.9 FM, are you mad or nah? Follow Revive Radio, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Revive underscore POC.